Hello friends, welcome back to our YouTube Genius Test Channel. Today we have an exciting game to analyze and dissect. The moves and tactics involved in this game will be adventurous. Now we can jump into the game. The game begins with a move P4, a popular and aggressive move, which opens up the center and allows for the development of white pieces. Black responds with C6, which is the Caracon defense, a solid and classical response. White continues with D4, advancing the pawn to claim control over the center. Black mirrors the move D5. White develops the knight on C3. Black captures the pawn on E4, which is an exchange in center. White continues with knight into E4. Knight F6, attacking the white knight on E4. White plays queen on D3 to support knight on E4. Black tries to open up the position E5, breaking the center and gaining space D into E5, threatening the knight on F6. Black responds with queen on A5. Check. Bishop on D2, threatening the queen. Queen into E5. Triple low. Now black captures the knight on E4. Now the brilliant low, queen on D8. King into D8. Discover check. Bishop on G5. King C7. Bishop on D8. Mate. Instead of King C7, King E8 means rook on D8. Mate. In summary, this game demonstrates the importance of development, controlling the center, and spotting tactical opportunities like discovered checks. It also shows the consequences of leaving the king in the center without proper protection. We hope this analysis has provided valuable insights and entertainment. So as you continue your chess journey, remember to stay curious, keep exploring new ideas, and most importantly, have fun on the chessboard. Thanks for joining us today. Please do like, share and subscribe our videos for more videos like this. Until next time, happy checkmating.